Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my dorm. So when I was about to move in, I watched these kind of videos over and over and over trying to get ideas, trying to find inspiration for how to decorate my dorm and I hope that this video will inspire someone else to do the same. Um, it's easier to film this because I finally got my tripod. Say hello tripod. Hello tripod. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I'm not really going to do Haley's side, which is over here. Haley is also behind the camera, if you can tell. Um, if she wants to do her side later, like, we can do that, whatever. But for today, I'm just going to show you, like, the stuff that we both use and the stuff on my side, what's under my bed, what I keep in my closet. Um, I might show you what's in my drawers. I don't know yet. What I keep in my desk, on my cart. And yeah, so I hope you enjoy. All right, so this is what you see when you first walk in. And I mean, it's like not fun things. It's like the trash can, the recycling bin, um, the TV, the microwave. I did a fridge tour on my um, in my last video. And I actually, since then, have changed my, I hate to call it a diet, but I changed that, my eating habits again. So if you guys wanna see another video of that, I might do one tomorrow, do a new grocery haul in a new fridge door because literally everything has changed. Um, we keep our TV on top of the microwave because it just works better like that. Um, Both of us can see it. <laughs> yeah, and we don't have a TV stand, obviously. We don't really have space for one either, so it just works better that way. Um, here's I me mean, self-explanatory. It's, oh, it's a sink. In the mirror. <laughs> and then under the sink, um, we keep cleaning supplies. This is my shower caddy. I have wipes back there because we run out of toilet paper a lot and nobody Agreed. feels like going downstairs to get it. Um, cleaning supplies, trash bags, air fresheners, extra toilet paper. I don't remember if I said plastic bags, but I keep those in there because that's what I take my lunch in. Um, hashtag, I need a lunch box. <laughs> At my mom, but it's not. <laughs> so on the top of the sink, we keep paper towels. And I think I'm going to start showing where things are telling you guys where things are from. This is from TJ Maxx and it was $9.99. I think it's highly worth it. You can't tell, but it's uh, heavy. Yeah. And it's just nice. It goes along with my theme. If you couldn't tell, my theme is white and gray. It goes with that. And then I have hand towels. This is for my um, hair when I wash my hair. Um, it washcloths. The hand towels, washcloths, and the towel in the bathroom are all, all from Amazon. And then this is from Target. It came in a two-pack. Um, I don't remember the prices of everything, and I'm not going to be one of those who links everything down below. Because that's, <laughs> that's too, too much work. Yeah. Just literally type in gray towels. I'm sure you'll find it. Um, uh, also in here, we keep our toothbrushes and toothpaste in this little mug. I painted it on the first night that I came here it has my initials if i would have known that we were going to use it for like a toothpaste cup i probably would have done something that represented both of us like age and age but it's too late for that and then i have my diffuser and that also came from amazon um currently we're using peppermint essential oil in there that's our favorite it's our go-to i mean we don't really use anything else since Haley's sick, I should probably be using eucalyptus, <laughs> but I haven't been. When I was sick, I was using eucalyptus, so I'll have to put some of that in there. So also over here, we have a wildfire. This is from Bath & Body Works, and I think, oh my god, I don't want to say this because I know my mom's going to judge me, but I think the wildfire itself was um, $12.99, and <laughs> it's also a nightlight, so I mean, that's cute. It keeps and, it light in here. Yes, and then... I have vanilla birch in here. It smells really, really good. Kind of like fall. I told Haley that I'm not putting sweater weather in until we are actually wearing <laughs> sweaters. Um, but yeah. And I think the wildflowers were on sale for like five for 23. So I also did that. So here's um, what my closet looks like. This is where I keep my shoes. I think I showed you guys this in my very first video. I have a lot of shoes. I probably need to get rid of some of them, but we all know I can't do that because what if I need to wear them one day and then I don't have them. <laughs> um, so then I have a laundry basket that came from Amazon. The wagon comes in handy for grocery shopping. I showed you guys that in my grocery haul. Um, that also came from Amazon. This shoe holder 
was a gift from Makaya. <laughs> Thank you, Makaya, if you're watching this. Um, but you better be watching this. <laughs> the fan also came from Amazon. I thought I was gonna need it, but honestly, they keep the dorms like freezing cold, so I really don't need it. But I'm still gonna keep it. And then um, next is my clothes. And on the right, you'll see I have extra towels and um, a turban. I call them turbans. It's whatever to dry your hair after you get out of the shower. And then my hangers are from Target, in case you wanted to know. They're from last year. And at the top, I have an air fryer, which I do most of my cooking in, as you would know if you watched my last video. Um, <laughs> um, I have fabric softener, which came from Walmart. All my laundry stuff came from Walmart. I have Tide Pods, dryer sheets, a uh, stain stick. I have two pairs of shoes that need to be kept in the box. I have some extra sheets up there. My hammock, I have some pads up there because, you know, girly things. Girly, just girly things. <laughs> and then I have my laptop box and my phone box up there in case, cause I have extra stuff in there like stickers and headphones and cords and stuff. And plus if anything happens to them, I have the box. So yeah, that's what the closet looks like. I mean, it's not that special, it's just, closet it is i do want to say it's smaller than the one that i had last year but i'm still able to fit everything in there pretty easy all right so here's my dresser it used to be under my bed but um i lowered my bed like three notches and so it wouldn't fit under there anymore which is fine because i needed more like quote unquote counter space anyways so on here i keep my water bottles the sunflower one i use for drinking in the room and the blue one i normally use when i'm uh, going to class or something I keep it in my backpack um, my laptop case is from Amazon I keep my books that I'm currently reading for my classes in the corner when I come back I just throw my keys um, right there the airpod case is from Amazon the lanyard is from the bookstore the wooden square that says she believes she could so she did came from TJ Maxx the picture frame of my brothers came from Target Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> the picture frame that says Finna Finna came from TJ Maxx as well. And I just want to say, um, so I say Finna a lot. I don't know if I've said in this video, but if you're around me in real life, I say Finna a lot. And so my roommate last year cross-stitched um, this thing that says Finna Finna with some flowers around it. So I framed it because it represents me very well. The lamp I got from Five Below. And then I'm not going to open the drawers because that's kind of weird. But in the top drawer, I keep my underwear, socks, um, pajamas, and bras in the top drawer. My second drawer is literally just shorts. And then the last drawer is leggings, shorts, and yeah, just leggings and shorts. I haven't, so. Pants? <laughs> no, I don't have pants. Um, so I left my winter clothes at home and I'll probably bring them after I get back from Thanksgiving break. Like I have pants, like leggings, and I have jeans, and I have jackets, so I don't really need my sweaters until after Thanksgiving, cause Lord knows it's still gonna be summer until then. All right, so here's the desk. Um, the printer that I got, I got on big, big sale from Target. It was um, originally like $159, and I got it on sale for $59, so that's a steal. I highly recommend it because um, a lot of times, well, first of all, it costs to print stuff out in the library. And also, a lot of times you don't want to go all the way to the library just to print something out. And if you have to print something out last minute, it works better. Um, the blanket on the chair used to be on my bed, but it wasn't big enough to cover my whole body because it's just a throw blanket. That is from Amazon. Um, the mirror that I used to get myself ready is... I'm not sure where that's from. My papa got it for me for Christmas. I'm pretty sure it's from Amazon though. Um, there's a basket under here with scrunchies and... <laughs> oh my God, look at my hair though. There's scrunchies, headbands, hair ties. I got these kind of hair ties so they don't rip out my hair. I have these kind. Yeah, extra. <laughs> um, in this bag, I have rubber bands for when I do braids and other things like that. The I got a 36 pack of scrunchies from Amazon for I think it was eight dollars. 
Um, I got like a hundred pack of these. I'm pretty sure I paid also $8 or something like that um, for them. The basket came from Target. Um, I have these succulents. They came from TJ Maxx. I have some medicine and some vitamins. Um, this whole desk piece actually came from Amazon. I actually love it. it. I feel like it pulls my desk together and without it, my desk would look a mess. Um, the black thing that holds my pens, pencils, or extra pens and pencils. I put my mascara up there to hide it. Um, I have scissors back there. There's tacks and extra printer ink and extra... One moment, please. <laughs> extra, um, there's extra tacks, extra staples, and extra printer ink in there. I have this little baby stapler because I don't really use staples that much. My Carmex is in there because I put Carmex on before I go to bed. My Apple Watch charger. My, oh, the black thing. I don't remember if I said this, but it came from Amazon. Um, the scissors came from Target. They were in like the college section. That was super cheap. The salt, my Himalayan salt lamp came from TJ Maxx. It was the last one on the shelf. In here, I keep all my important like paperwork. I'm not really gonna show that because I might have my stuff on it. And also my wireless charger. Don't use that either. Someone wants to buy it, let me know because I don't use it. <laughs> yeah, I don't. So in here, um, I normally sit there to get ready. So I have <laughs> eyelashes that I never put on unless I'm home. I have extra wallflowers, uh, extra wallet, extra phone case. This is my favorite essential oil, peppermint. I told you guys that's what we're using right now. It's our favorite. I have my earrings in here. Some eyelash glue that's actually weave glue, but we're just gonna ignore that for now. <laughs> um, here's what I bought at the beginning of the summer with essential oils in it. I used it all up. Like I had, I had um, peppermint and lavender in here, which were my two favorites, and obviously they're gone because I used them all up. But honestly, people, the sweet orange, the lemongrass, frankincense smells like okay. Sweet orange, lemongrass, frankincense all smell like shit by themselves. Agreed. <laughs> Preach. They smell so bad. So bad. But if you mix frankincense with like peppermint, it's okay. Eucalyptus is good with peppermint. It's also alright by itself. Depends. Tea tree is good if you mix it with peppermint. I feel like everything's good if you mix it with peppermint. Except <laughs> not sweet orange and not lemongrass. Agreed. <laughs> Those are so nasty. Um... Anyways, I have my flat iron in there. I rarely ever flat iron my hair because I'm trying to get it healthy. <laughs> but yeah, that's my desk for the most part. All right, so in here I keep all my bath and body work stuff. Under here I keep printer paper, um, a binder with a um, flat practical in it, some extra books that I don't need at the moment, extra notebooks. I keep my brushes and my comb in there. But yeah, deodorant, nothing too special. All right, so this is the cart. It's kind of like my pantry, so to speak. I got the cart itself from Amazon. My Keurig came from Amazon on Prime Day. Um, I got this little container. The little container that holds the fork, spoons, and knives and cooking utensils is from Target in that college section, along with those gray bowls and gray plates. Those also came from Target. And those gray cups under there. Um... I mean, it's self-explanatory. I got the oven mitts, the measuring spoons, they're all from Walmart. My Nutribullet, if you guys want a video, I just started this. Um, it's some really healthy stuff up under there, but I just started it and I got my Nutribullet and everything from Walmart. And yeah, everything on this cart is mostly the food-wise, it's from Target or Walmart, and then like the Keurig and the cart are from Amazon. All right, so this is what my bed looks like. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen it before. Um, my bed set, like the comforter set, all came from Amazon. The reading pillow is from Amazon. The pink blanket is from Target. The No Bad Days pillow is from TJ Maxx. Uh, the white pillow is a my pillow, but the pillowcase came from Amazon with the comforter set. The pillow behind the white pillow, the big gray pillow, is also on my pillow, but my head slips off of it because 
I decided to buy silk sheets because <laughs> I heard that silk sheets, well, I didn't buy silk sheets, I bought a silk pillowcase because I heard it's better for your hair and your skin. But it can't be better for your hair and your skin if your head won't stay on the pillow. Agreed. So it's just kind of there to make the bed look more put together. When I actually go to sleep, I throw all the gray pillows on the floor except for my body pillow. And that's what I use. The body pillow in the back is from Target along with the cover is also from Target. Um, my MacBook, I mean. It's from Mac? No, <laughs> it's from Apple. Oh. <laughs> that's how you can tell you're not Apple. <laughs> it's okay though. If you didn't know, we live in DeGraff, DeGraff West, and that's our view. Wow. Yeah, kind of nice, I guess. <laughs> So I just wanted to include this. The bed set has pockets, y'all. So I keep my phone charger in there. It's attached to an extension cord because the plugs in this room are not really accessible. So I normally put my phone in there when I go to sleep and it works out really well. All right, so I love the bed skirt. It came with the comforter set and it hides all of my stuff. So honestly, when you come in the room, you would never know that it's here. But for the sake of this tour, I'm gonna just tuck it up here. So I have these storage containers and honestly, they are lifesavers. Um, this is my most used storage container. I keep all my extra things like hairspray, Q-tips, toothbrush. I have some medicine in there, face wash, makeup remover, band-aids, razors, toothpaste. I have extra gum in there, extra soap. Well, the soap was from washing my tattoo. But extra tattoo cream because um i have nail clippers antibiotic ointment coconut oil because we like to stay moisturized over here i have nail polish remover although i don't really paint my nails that much i used to paint my own toes but i don't do that anymore <laughs> <laughs> too bougie for that in this big storage container i have extra plates extra forks <laughs> they fell out of the box and i was too lazy to put them back in the box so yeah that's the story on that i have extra peppermint tea i have more peppermint tea up there so i don't really need it out right now paper bowls um extra tupper containers extra forks extra knives i'm out of spoons but honestly i can just use a fork <laughs> A lot of spoons up there if you guys saw um this storage container is pretty empty because it's most of the stuff that was in here had to be put somewhere else what i have oh light bulbs from amazon mm -hmm. i have extra pens and pencils well let me show you this i probably shouldn't show you this for my own privacy but i'm gonna show you guys this is a safe it is it looks like a dictionary but when you open it it's a safe right now i have pictures in there that i really need to hang up um but like if you had a roommate that you didn't trust that's not the case for me <laughs> you could um put your belongings in here um i have a lint roller that i never use because i don't really care about lint also we don't, we don't no. have anything that lints yeah we don't have dogs agreed just really sad agreed I have note cards. I also didn't know this. Mom, <laughs> let me know if you want these wallflowers because I have two extras and you saw that I just bought that really extravagant one. So if you want this one, let me know. I'll bring it home. That'll be a true test to see if she watches my videos because she'll tell me whether she wants these wallflowers. <laughs> um, well, I didn't even know that I had this. Another wallflower. What does it smell like? I don't know. I'll find out. Ooh, that smells good. Ooh, that smells good. All right, we'll save this for like when we run out of other things, yeah. Those. When we run out of vanilla birch, but it's still not sweater weather. <laughs> yes, that's what we'll use. I think that's what's that amber one? I know you guys know. If you're if you're a bad body works fanatic, it's the orange one. They used to be called amber amber something, but I forget. All right, so under here, I keep my luggage for when I go home. It's nothing spectacular. Actually, the one on top is my brother's. It literally says my brother's whole name on it. But I needed a big one to bring all my clothes over here. So that's why I bought that one. 
Um, this is the last storage container. I have a shower curtain. Did I tell you guys where all that? Yeah, I did tell you guys where all that stuff was from. This is another gift from Makaya. Thank you, Makaya, if you're watching this, which, like I said, you better be watching this. Um, extra body wash because it won't fit in my other extras container. Extra loofah because you should replace these. Don't quote me on this. I'm pretty sure it's every three months. Yeah. Every three months because they hold bacteria. Nasty. Extra sponges. Oh, I didn't know that I had these. <laughs> My God. That's good because I was about to buy some more. Um, extra trash bags. Cotton balls. Paper towels. I mean, it's like grown up boring adult things. Like, things <laughs> you need to stock your we're gonna call this our house things you need to stock your house so this is the door to our bathroom it's right beside um the sink and it has a inappropriate tiktok on it right now so we just <laughs> ignore that um so when you go in the mat the bathroom is from target i'm pretty sure the shower curtain is also from target and got some towels you know a trash can my towel <laughs> That's not mine. That's not. Um, in case you guys wanted to, to see how big the shower is, it's like this. It's pretty big. Yeah, it is pretty big. It has a big caddy, but we put in our sweet made agreement that we're not keeping our stuff in here, which is fine. I don't want to keep my stuff in here. Agreed. Agreed. <laughs> Reason unbeknownst to us. <laughs> no shade, no tea. But yeah, that's the bathroom. It's nothing special, but it's definitely nicer than the one that I had last year. Agreed. Ooh. <laughs> so much sunshine. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching my dorm tour. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down in the comments below. And I'll answer them if you want to know where anything is from. Or if you have any questions about the functionality of our dorm, don't hesitate to ask. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys.